What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today I got a recipe that I'm sure is gonna knock your socks off. Per capita in the United States of America, cheeseburgers are the most purchased and most consumed foods out of any other. I'm actually not sure if that's true, but it sounded good. No matter where you go, they got a cheeseburger for sale. And I'm also guilty of it. I can go to a restaurant that has some of the rarest delicacies in the world. And if I see a bacon cheeseburger on that menu, I'm like, hey, give me one of those, double the meat and add a side of fries, well done. It's an easy go-to that never lets you down. But unfortunately, most of these restaurants aren't choosing quality ingredients, which you can end up with when you get a gourmet burger is something that is loaded down with fat, loaded down with calories, not as much protein as it could have, not doing your body any good, and most importantly, it just ain't anabolic. But today, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna change that. In today's video, we'll be making an anabolic PB&J burger. We're taking all the deliciousness of a juicy double cheeseburger with bacon, and we're adding our own custom peanut butter and jelly. If you've been wanting to live on the wild side, but the idea of jumping out of a plane or knocking over a bank seems a little too dangerous and you'd rather settle for a sandwich, then look no further than this video because I'm telling you, it just might change your life. And for all the diet secrets and hacks to make amazing food at home that's gonna fit into your diet behind protein and lowering calories, all while satisfying those cravings, check out my cookbook at the first link in the description. Got every recipe on this channel broken down in an easy to use guide and this sucker fits right in your pocket. Plus, all you do is get it once and every time I drop a new video with a new recipe, it gets updated for free and you get that version. It's seriously a steal, baby. Link down below in my description. All right, baby. If you guys are ready for an epic video underway, then as always, man, I'm here to do it for you. Let's do it! Yeah! So when we're trying to make an optimized burger, one of the most crucial components is choosing the right buns. So what we're gonna be using is a 90 calorie potato roll. So I'll just take one out of the pack, split it in half, then I'll just let it toast on my Phillips tabletop grill. Keep in mind, you can do this in a skillet as well. I'll just hit this with a little nonstick and set this on here for a few minutes. And while that's toasting, I'm gonna get my bacon ready. So I'm gonna take a slice of turkey bacon, and in order to give it a quick crisp, I'm just gonna toss it in my air fryer basket. Then I'll just air fry it at 400 degrees for about four to five minutes till it crisps up. And now we will move on to the patties. What I have here is 224 grams of 96% lean ground beef that I've split into two 112 gram piles. What I'm gonna do here is go in, press down, and slowly form these into thin patties. The thinner they are, the faster they'll cook, and they'll end up overall holding more juice when you don't have to overcook the outside to make that middle how you want it. And now that we got both patties looking pretty good, as far as seasonings go, I don't wanna go too crazy. We're gonna have the peanut butter and the jelly flavor. So we don't want too many things clashing, but I will do a nice light coating of salt on just one side. I'm gonna do that to both patties. I'm also do a light layer of pepper. And then now all I'm gonna do is sit them on my grill and give these bad boys a quick fry. Now when it comes to the peanut butter and jelly, we won't be using traditional peanut butter and jelly because calories. But we're gonna do the next best thing. We're gonna make our own protein peanut butter using PB Fit powder. And instead of sugar loaded strawberry jam, we'll be using sugar free strawberry preserves with added fiber. So I'm gonna weigh out eight grams of PB Fit powder in a small bowl. Then we will just add a tiny bit of water to this. Then I'll just use a spoon and stir it together until it constitutes into a thick, creamy peanut butter. And at this point, the burgers are ready for a flip. Go in and bingo, looking beautiful, and bingo. Now I'm gonna add a slice of cheese so it starts melting. I'm gonna be using Velveeta cheese, only 40 calories, and it's a better option than traditional full fat cheese, but I think it gives you all the flavor and then some. So I'll just sit this right on here and let it melt while this finishes up. And at this point, we can officially start building. I have my bottom toasted bun. I'm gonna place on 17 grams of our sugar-free strawberry preserves, spread them out, make sure we get that flavor in every bite. Next up, we will lay down our first patty. Then I'm gonna take my piece of crispy air fryer bacon, rip it in half, place it right on top, follow that up with our second patty. And then finally, I'm gonna take my PB Fit powder that we reconstituted into protein peanut butter, spread it right on the top bun, give it a quick little spread. And then finally, we will place that bun right on top. And boom, baby, I present to you the anabolic PB&J bacon burger. Mm. 
ladies and gentlemen, will you check out this beautiful burger? We have two lean beef patties, lightly seasoned with some crispy air fried bacon. We got the melted cheese. We got the strawberry jam on the bottom and that melted peanut butter up top. I know what you're thinking. This combination of flavors doesn't sound like it'd be appealing, but I promise you, you try this right here, it just might be your new favorite thing. If you made it this far into the video, please smash that thumbs up button for me. Do you have a signature burger that you like at your favorite restaurant? Maybe it's a unique burger, a unique twist. Comment it down below. And if it sounds like a good time, I will work on it and see if I can't make it anabolic. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. And before this gets cold, ladies and gentlemen, I think you know what time it is. Let's give this thing a shot. Here we go. But first, we try this immaculate creation out. Another immaculate creation. The white chocolate fruity cereal crunch and a bar. This is hands down my favorite flavor. If you don't like regular protein bars, this one tastes like a candy bar with 21 grams of protein. Sheesh, sheesh. You ain't beating that, man. I'll put this up against any other bar on a taste test and I guarantee we win. Not even just win. We beat them, we take their wives, we slowly settle into a role as the father of that family. It's an overwhelming victory is what I'm saying. And you can take part in that at final BossFormers.com. Code RGF10 will save you 10% now with extremely fast shipping. Comparable to Amazon Prime. Get in there, baby. All right, I've been looking forward to this all freaking day. Let's get in here. You already know what we got, man. Look at that. You already know. Meat, cheese, peanut butter, bacon, jelly. Come on now. I'm gonna take that picture perfect bite right here in the front. Y'all ready? Three, two, one, let go. This is such a unique combination of flavors, but it's a banger. It tastes like a double cheeseburger with bacon, but the peanut butter and jelly just does something on the back end that I can't explain. Can't explain it, you gotta try it. It literally has no right to be this good. This is the type of sandwich you wanna eat when you're going through a midlife crisis and you wanna recapture your youth, you know? The simpler times of PB and J's, before taxes, before divorce, before rampant online slander trying to paint you to look like a villain. Before all of that, it was simpler and it was peanut butter and jelly. This is a hit, baby. It's a classic. It's up there with Drake's Take Care or Kanye's Late Registration. It's, it's a classic. You gotta make this one. I know you'll love it. Now in this entire burger, if you make it exactly how I did it, which end up with for the entire double bacon peanut butter jelly burger, which end up with for the whole thing is only 484 calories, 16 grams of fat, 59 grams of protein, 26 grams of carbs, six grams of fiber. For a double cheeseburger with bacon, with peanut butter and jelly, I would say those are uh, immaculate macros. And I get 50 59 grams of protein in this bad boy, and it's gonna fit right into my diet for the day. Like I always preach, it's not the fact that you're eating burgers that's making you fat, it's not the ice cream that's making you fat, it's literally the amount of calories you're eating in a day. As long as you're eating in a calorie deficit and you're eating enough protein, you really can't lose, man. You can fit foods like this in your diet all freaking day. Dieting has never tasted this good. And if you've never air fried turkey bacon before, game changer. Makes it crispy, makes it taste very similar to regular bacon, except we're not getting all those calories, right? Half the battle is just making those changes in your diet where you're eating the same foods, but it's the best versions of them. Ladies and gentlemen, we have made it to the final bite. Let's go. Mm. And that is a 10 out of 10. I don't even gotta say nothing else. I'm not even gonna try to sell it to you here. That was perfect. You gotta make that. You gotta tag me. You gotta let me know what you think, man. And for the perfect recipe guide in your pockets, you can make all these recipes. Have them right at your fingertips. Check out my cookbook, link down below in the description. If you already got the book, if you already got it once, then go get the updated copy because this is now in there. You can get to making magic happen in your kitchen right away, man. Appreciate you guys, as always, for checking out the channel. Smash that thumbs up button. Leave your video suggestions down below in the comment box. Leave a comment in general to help with that algorithm. It's tough going on YouTube these days. A lot of people competing for views. The more comments and likes videos get, the better they do. So when you guys do that, helps a ton and I appreciate it. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. And until next time, ladies and gents, I will see every one of you at the next video. See you guys. Whew. Whew, that was incredible, boy. Sheesh.